So let's talk about solving this um, equation for y. And so first thing you want to notice is with that denominator, you'd like to get rid of the denominator. So we're going to multiply both sides by this denominator, or basically cross multiply it. So it's going to get multiplied over to here by the 1. So I'm going to have negative 9y minus x equals 6 minus x times 5 minus 6y. So now I've gotten rid of my denominator and um, now we need to concentrate on solving for y. Well there's two y's in here. You can see you got one here and one here. And we need to get those on the same side. But before we can do that, we'd really like to get rid of the parentheses over here on the right hand side. So I'm going to distribute this x. And so on the right hand side I've got 6 minus 5 times x. Multiplied by this term, minus 6xy. Excuse me, that's a negative x times a negative 6y, so that'll become a positive. Over here we still have minus 9y minus x. Now because we're trying to solve for y, what we want to do is get all the terms with y on the same side, all the terms without y on the other side. So, let's get, let's move this term to so the minus 6xy. I'm going to subtract that from both sides. And what I'll also need to do is I'll also need to add x. I'll do that in the next step. So right now I've got negative 9y minus 6xy equals 6 minus 5x. Okay. Now, oh, and I'm missing a negative x in here. Let's get that back in here. So we also have, excuse me, a minus x on this side. I almost forgot it, this term here. Equals 6 minus 5x. And so here's where we're at. Now let's add x to both sides. And you'll see why we're doing that in a second. So over here, I've got negative 9y minus 6xy left. Over here, I've got 6, and then I've got negative 5x plus an x, so plus a 4, excuse me, not plus, geez, minus 4x. The reason I did that is because now over here, I have two y's, but they're on the same side, so what I'm going to do is factor a y out, and rewrite that left-hand side as y times negative 9 minus 6x equals 6 minus 4x. Alright, we're almost there. Basically now we're just going to divide. So we're going to divide both sides by negative 9 minus 6x because that will cancel out on the left hand side. So those two cancel and we get y equals 6 minus 4x over negative 9 minus 6x. And now we've solved for y.